happening today. The Great American Outdoor Show is back at the Farm Show Complex after two years. Sonica Bargo reports. The outdoor show was canceled last year because of COVID-19. One vendor told me it's a little smaller this year, but it is still good to be back. The exhibits are gorgeous. For Susie Clark and John Davis, the Great American Outdoor Show is something they won't miss. We've been here when it's, there's a blizzard. No matter what the weather, we get here. They've been traveling from Maryland to Harrisburg to visit the show for 20 years, except in 2021, when COVID shut down the annual event. We missed the show, I'll say that. They're not the only ones glad to be back. There were lines outside the door. NRA spokesperson Amy Hunter Wright says she wasn't sure what this year would look like after a two year gap, but so far it's a success. It's such a rich American tradition, the outdoor life, and to be able to have this event and have everyone come together again, is just it's just been wonderful. Wright says the show has something for everyone. For Davis and Clark, it's the art. We just bought a piece. I've got a piece in my bag right now. And the hunting. Don's always up for buying more uh, antlers. His wall's full of it, but he always gets another piece. The show might be a little smaller than usual. Not as many people are here that, you know, friends and stuff like that, because some states are still fighting with COVID. But for Black Bear Outfitters owner Gary Greaves, that's okay. This is our vacation. <laughs> for Greaves, Davis and Clark, it's about more than business. It's like being in the woods because you're with all the same type people. Just the people you meet, good people. An NRA spokesperson also told me the show has a $75 million impact on the area with people staying in hotels and eating at local restaurants. The show runs until next Sunday. In the studio, Sonica Bargo, ABC 27 News.